Welcome back to our channel, Kentucky Fried Fun, and welcome if you are new. Today, I am going to be doing a spring clean and decorate with me. So if you want some cleaning motivation and see what I put out as just some simple, pretty decor for spring until Easter comes, stay tuned. Don't leave me here forever. Don't let me be alone. If you like Clean With Me, be sure to leave my video a big thumbs up. If you like what you see in this video today, I would love it if you head on over to my channel and browse through it. While you are there, you will find more cleaning motivation and decoration inspiration. I am also currently going through a 12 week declutter series and you will find an occasional DIY on my channel. And today I'm actually doing a super easy one for spring decor that you can do. When I change out decor for the seasons, I like to make sure that I give a thorough wipe down of the shelf where the de decorations were sitting, and that is what I am doing here. I am using my Mrs. Meyers all-purpose spray in the rosemary scent, and once I have it all wiped down, I'm just going to be taking our little dog's things and putting them back up on that shelf where I typically keep them. And I do actually have a video of me taking down our other Valentine's decor that I had up in our Airbnb and I'll be sure to leave a link to that video up in the cards and down in the description box if you would like to check that out. This is part of a challenge that is being hosted by two of my favorite ladies here on YouTube, Drea from Clueless Mama D and Kristen from Kristen's Chaotic Life. I absolutely love both of these ladies. Drea has a lot of energy in her videos and her editing is boss. And Kristen, I've been following her for over a year now, or about a year, ever since I've been on YouTube, and she has excellent cleaning motivation over on her channel. And I will be sure to leave a link to both of their channels up in the cards and down in the description box and this challenge is simply a spring clean and decorate with me and if when you're finished with my video you need some more cleaning motivation I will have a link to all of the other ladies and their cleaning videos up in the cards at the end of this video and down in the description box In this video, you will actually see me taking down my Valentine's Day tablescape, but if you come back on Sunday, you will see that as well as what I put on my table for Mardi Gras. Now I am in our bathroom and I'm just taking down everything off of that shelf there and I'll be dusting that along with some other touch points in the bathroom that I don't get to on a normal basis before I decorate it. For decoration, I'm going to be using these pretty flowers that I found from a Dollar Tree. They are lilacs and they're white. I absolutely loved them. I'm going to be arranging them in this little jar that I found. I believe it was at Mighty Dollar and it took me a little while to rearrange them, but once I had them how I wanted them, I set them back up on the shelf. And then I'll be also setting on this shelf this sign that I recently found at a thrift haunt and it just says pray more worried less and as always I only paid half off which was only a dollar and I thought it was super cute with the gold touch to it and it just being neutral because as you can see our shower curtain has a lot of color to it and our bathroom is small so I like to keep the decor in here fairly neutral that way it doesn't seem too busy. Thank you. 
After moving things around, I finally decided to use one of these candle stands that I had painted for a challenge last fall and I absolutely love how it brought some height to the candle and I am loving how this all turned out. I love having the sign there. It is such a great reminder to see every day. Now for my DIY, and for my DIY, I'm going to be using this container that I found at Goodwill, $5 but half off $2.50. It was originally supposed to be like a container garden with a seed starter kit, but that's not what I was going to use it for. I simply wanted the container, and I just unwrapped it, washed it out in the sink, and then for my filler, I'm actually going to be using a grocery bags. That's right, grocery bags, because I didn't happen to have any of like the green foam stuff on hand, but it worked out just perfect because I had some of the green or the moss from Dollar Tree to cover it on the top. And then once I had made sure there was no spots where you could see a grocery bag, I started putting in the succulents and I did buy each of these from Dollar Tree. I'm absolutely loving their selection they have right now. It just, oh it's so much fun y'all. I even went the other day and bought three more. I love them so much. I decided to set this on our coffee table. I just love how it is looking there. It is just so, so pretty, y'all. Next, I just hung this sign that I found from a Dollar Tree. I absolutely love it. I love the color, obviously, and the saying is celebrate everything. If you know me, that is me. I love to celebrate every holiday, every season, and I had to get this one. So I'm just setting it up above where our dog's little things are. The next area that I wanted to decorate was our entryway and for that I'm just going to be using this little sign that I found from a Dollar Tree that says enjoy the journey and I thought that was perfect right by the door. And then this sign says spring is in the air. I found that actually at Goodwill, but I believe it is actually from Dollar Tree. I found that sometime in last year. And so I thought that was a perfect sign to hang there on our coat wrap. The last thing that I wanted to do was actually outside. I just wanted to stick out these lights to light up our pathway up the stairs. And here I'm just reminding y'all to pull out the little orange tab. I know I forget to do that, that way they actually work. And I am just putting them in and taking out the snowman ones that I had in during the Christmas and winter season. y'all enjoyed watching me do some spring cleaning and decorating. If you did, please be sure to leave my video a big thumbs up and if you are new, I would love it if you would subscribe and click that little bell because I do have some more cleaning and decorating videos coming out in the near future and I wouldn't want y'all to miss out on that. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have a blessed day and I'll see y'all later. Bye!